so here's the deal. What I wanted to talk about. Uh, where did I get a circle? Yeah, I just quickly sketched the map. You're right. Okay. So let's analyze this circle. Let's see how much land you have in the circle. Um, it's almost the same, isn't it? Like a bit more here, possibly. Yeah, like, I don't know. Let's say 60-40. 60 for the island, 40 here. And people are going to think, ah, it's probably not worth crossing because... And this is a pretty common circle, by the way. It, it, the, the second one goes down here quite a lot. Well, let's say the center is here. It's just, you know, you, whatever. It doesn't matter. This, the center is here. Uh, right here. So it is on the island. And uh, people are going to say, ah, it's, it's, uh, this is 60-40. But the actual truth is... This is the area... Where you should oh, 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 oh how you should measure it no cursor oh you see i didn't click oh i'm sorry i'm so sorry okay all right again if you look at the white circle let's say let's say it's 50 50 all right and people that are up here they're gonna say it's 50 50 there's no point crossing if it's 50 50. okay 50 50 but number one for new circle number one rule is it cannot be in water that's simple enough. Everyone understands that. So the center of the next circle cannot be in the water. Let's say... Let's say this is the center. I didn't draw it correctly, but it doesn't matter. Let's say this is the center. Whatever. So this is not on water. And the number two rule is... The, the new circle has to be inside the, the previous one. So you cannot have a center up here or, or here because the next circle is too big. It will be outside, okay? So how it works? You always look at a smaller circle that's, that has the same center, much smaller circle, like four times smaller when it comes to area. Um... You look at that area. So this is marked with red. And now in this area, you try to see what the ratio is. And now you see the true picture. This is not a 50-50. This is like an 80-20. Because the next circle can only be up here. Of this whole area can only be up here. While in this area, like in this area, can be all of this. So let's say it's an 80-20. It's not perfectly drawn, but that's how it works. And the bridge is also technically a possibility, but I don't really understand how it works with the bridge. So overall, this is how you conclude. Especially later on in the game. You can get some uh, weird circles, uh, let's say. Let's say here. Alright, so let's analyze this. There's more land down here than up here so this is like a let's say 40 60 it's 50 50 I, I could bet that there's more land on the bottom like total land so you're gonna say this is a 60 40 there's no point but then you draw the smaller circle which is a circle of candidate centers of the new one yeah it's up whoa it's all the way up here actually and then you realize like oh my god this is a 70 30 for the top yeah Caligan no 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 you're right because it, in this circle, in this white circle, you have to go up. Because it's much more likely for the next one to uh, to go up. And once it goes up, it rarely goes back. Because it's... This is the ideal case, if it's here. But it typically goes further up, and then it's over. Does it apply to look for where the drop goes? Like... No, no. Drop is... 
Okay, here's how drop works. Let me let me try to explain that too. Okay, here's how drops work. Sometimes you get a bit confused with drops. It has nothing to do where the next circle is going to be, but... Let's say you have this white circle, only the white circle. Uh, we can just refresh this. Alright, you have this circle. And the plane is coming in. From here. And it drops here. Okay. So that is the first situation that can happen. And then uh, here's the next one. You have this circle and after that you have this circle. And there's a plane coming. And it drops here. And you're like, what the hell? So how it works is... When the plane appears, when it spawns... At that moment, you don't even see it then. It, because it's somewhere... It's The plane spawns here, guys. Like, over here. You don't... You never see it when it just spawns. Unless you're on the edge of the map. That's when it decides where it's gonna drop. And then, five seconds later, you get a new circle. And the plane may or may not drop in the new circle, depending on when it spawned. Because it always looks at the current circle at the time of its uh, appearance, okay? And it generally drops here. If, if that happened to uh, be the case. But it also might drop inside, even though it's... It spawned later, it can still drop inside in the new circle. So yeah, that's how that works. You hopefully understood this. So we said... We said... Um, I don't know. For this one... If you look at the white circle... So if you only look at the white circle, you might say... Oh, there's almost as much land here as there is here. Let's say... 55... 45... But if you look at what's important, and that is the, the circle of the candidate centers, let's call it that way, then it's a 80-20. Whoops. 80-20. And this is what matters. This this completely useless info, amount of land inside the circle, that is useless. You only look at this circle, your imaginary circle, that's not, that has the same center, it's just much smaller. Like half the radius let's say because let's say this circle this is how big the next circle is gonna be um let's use blue i know i'm using different but this is the same size all right so you can fit this circle okay maybe it's a bit bigger you can fit this circle anywhere even if it's on the edge of this red okay but it cannot go outside, so if you do like a loop around and you have like a pen on the on the center of this blue circle, you would get the red circle. If you if you understand what I'm trying to po point out, that is how you get this one. Th that is how you try to imagine this red circle. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't miss the live action on my stream at Twitch3 slash Breezy. See you in the next video.